Criminator 14 with some coins I've gotten recently. Um, before I begin the week of the 17th of February, I do have off from school, so I'm hoping to make a complete collection video this time. I'm going to have all the coins spread out. It's just if I can find another table or not, because I have three and I don't think that'll be enough. But hopefully. So, first thing I got is an Isabella Quarter. I was going to get a graded MS one, but this one was a good deal. Um, the black on it is not a scratch, it's like just something black on it. And my coin dealer, who is also a professional coin appraiser, valued this at $300. I paid much less than that, I'm not going to tell you how much. And the reverse. And then, just to give you a quick little overview, since I've gotten a bunch of stuff since I last showed you this book. The ones with numbers above or below, I have graded, and that is the grade of them. Uh, so, I'm only missing the Lafayette and Panama Pacific from this page, besides the graded ones. And on this page, I'm missing three, Hudson, Spanish Trail, and Hawaii, which I'll probably never get. Most of these are in MS. Favorite is the Texas. Just doing a little overview. Most of these are in other videos. <coughs> in this page, I'm missing quite a few. I do have a new Rochelle coming. Roanoke, uh, that might be a 65, I'm not sure. And then I do have doubles of some of these. New Rochelle is the one I have coming. And there's a bunch of empty spots. Might put a couple Booker T. Washingtons or Carvers in there. And then just... This is my 1921 Pilgrim. I do have the 20 in MS-63. But I wanted to have them for the book. And then did upgrade my Monroe. And I'm not really sure. Oh, I put in today the Delaware. Try turning the camera around instead of turning the whole book. That's gonna work. And then the other coin, which is pretty much what this video was supposed to be for, uh, 1909S Lincoln, not VDB. I'm gonna get the VDB eventually. Um, not sure when right now. Uh, this is copper, so it's coming up really dark. It does have some red in it, though. Ooh, there's stuff falling. a better view. I think this probably could get ex extra fine 40, but I'd be happy with very fine 35 on this. Might get it graded, I'm not sure. I'll get my loop. Uh, there we go, you can see the S right there. The light is making it a little... This isn't really working out very well. And the, the it has really nice wheat lines on it. Not really good at filming copper. I think you can see those wheat lines are full. So I'm going to say extra fine 40, conservatively probably very fine 35, but we'll see. Uh, so that's pretty much it for this video, thanks for watching. 
Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get my complete coin collection video with everything all spread out so you can actually see it up by the week of the 17th. So thanks for watching, like, comment, and subscribe as always, and after I have my complete coin collection video, I will have a contest with silver. So thanks.